is Shenmue 4 finally being made and Yuzuzuki claims he will not be making it for fans this time. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As always, this is Sketchy Mary and I'm here to bring you the latest in Shenmue news, so let's get started. Now, Yu Suzuki recently did an interview with IG in Japan where he stated that he believes that Shenmue 4 will happen, but he plans on making it appeal to a wider audience this time around. I made Shenmue 3 for the fans, but next time I want to do something new. Suzuki agreed that as an independent company, if Shenmue 4 happens, he has to appeal it to a wider audience this time around. He did state that Shenmue 3 was made solely for the fans and he wasn't necessarily thinking about making money, but as a company, he does have to think about profit going forth. If I have the opportunity to make Shenmue 4, and I think I will, I know how to satisfy casual users, so I want to make a game that everyone can be satisfied with. He also stated that he has already been researching ways to improve the potential fourth game. He feels that he's able to make good changes without changing Shenmue's distinct personality. He ended the interview by saying, I hope fans who waited 20 years for Shenmue 3 and were satisfied will show the same demand for Shenmue 4. Now what are your thoughts? Do you think Yu Suzuki should market Shenmue 4 towards casual and new fans, or should he continue to focus on the original fans who technically got the third one in the works? Let me know in the comments below. In other news, Shenmue 3 did fine, but it wasn't a mass market game. Now according to the parent company of Deep Silver, Shenmue 3 performed fine financially, but it was too niche to make a great profit. Now just because Shenmue 3 performed financially fine, this does not guarantee the sequel in any way. In a presentation focused around earnings, the Embracer Group CEO explained what all this means. Shenmue 3 is an IP and a product I love and I know I think financially it's fine and I'm glad that the core fans are pleased. However, I think it's a challenge to see this as a mass market product. This is a core niche product and I think that's the comment I'd like to do on that game. Now, upon the initial launch of Shenmue 3, it did earn the number 17 spot on the UK charts and it sold over 18,000 copies its first week in Japan. Now, the game also collected $6.3 million with 70,000 backers, which earned it the highest funded video game in Kickstarter history. Now, you can see how this would affect the statistics sales traditionally, seeing as how many people already purchased the game when they funded the Kickstarter, so they wouldn't necessarily be buying the game again when the initial launch happened. However, through all of this, Yu Suzuki still seems very optimistic when it comes to continuing the story. For as long as there are those who wish to see Shenmue 3 live on, I will never give up on my own personal journey to complete the story. I sincerely hope that together, we can continue to spin the tale of Ryo and his adventures in Shenmue 4. Now, just because Embracer Group might not be pleased with the financial performance of Shenmue 3, it does not mean that Shenmue 4 is completely out of the table. This would mean that YSNet would have to simply find another way to fund the game. Now, the last thing I wanted to talk about was my challenge that I threw out there for the whole Shenmue community. I challenged everyone to try and beat my score in the QTE title arcade game in Shenmue 1. If you haven't seen that video, it'll be in the link in the description. Definitely check it out. But I have been blown away by the scores that I have seen. You guys really came for me. Like you didn't give me no mercy. You really came out here attacking and the scores are insane. I will definitely follow that story and keep you guys posted on who is winning in the QTE title arcade battle. <laughs> Now that is gonna be it for today. As always, I hope you guys learned something and don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Also, don't forget to tweet about Shamu, post about Shamu, you know, support the community. We're all really excited and hoping that we get Shenmu 4. And the best way to keep this franchise alive and going is to just talk about it 
spread awareness and hopefully we will get Shenmue 4 sooner rather than later because Lord knows I cannot wait another decade for the fourth game. I need to kill Landy. Well, maybe not kill him, but you know, I just need to fight him. A full battle is what I need. <laughs> so as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.